3rd of April, got a busy-ish week this week. We're in the office today, just, you know, catching up on correspondence. Um, <laughs> and then Thursday, off down to a place called King Edward Mine to take some photos of food and a cafe called the Kraus Hut. We should also be doing a read-through with Grant and Tom for the drop-off. Friday, we might be doing some location scouting slash taking some more photos for a place here on the park and then Saturday and Sunday I'm off down to King Edward Mine again to take some photos for the mine. Sort of stock photos of like families riding bikes, horse riding, all sorts of fun stuff like that. So hopefully a fun filled vlogging week. So it's the 6th of April. Um, relatively early, on my way down to a cafe that's called the Kraust Hut, which opens tomorrow, um, and the chef is cooking up the entire menu, so I'm going to take photos of all the food. Um, and Aiden's in the office today, so it'll probably cut between me down in Camborne and Aiden in the office. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm going to be here working on stuff to do with the drop-off short film that we're making within the next couple of weeks. And you've probably heard us talking about the drop-off in our previous vlogs. And if you don't know what it is, I don't imagine you do because we didn't really give much context. It's a direct sequel to a short film we made last year called Nine Lives. Oh my god! To sort of take it back to the origins of these films. In February 2014, when myself and Rob were still in uni, I made a film called Breaking In. It was just an exercise in keeping things simple and easy when it comes to actually making a short film. Proving that, you know, you can make good short films with limited resources and, you know, your friends. It turned out okay, it's kind of dated now, but the idea and the structure was there. We sort of elevated that and took those two characters and put them in another situation, another film, and that was Nine Lives. We made Nine Lives last year and it turned out really good. Festivals picked it up, got some award recognition. Nine Lives was such a fun film to make and the story is so simple and so fun to watch. We thought we'd put these characters back in the situation and see what happens after. So yeah, it's a direct sequel to Nine Lives. It also references Breaking In. All done down the mine now. Just gonna go straight home and start editing the photos. Up early tomorrow because we're going out and we get the very first shot of the drop off at about six in the morning. So we need to leave at like half five-ish. It's a drone shot and we want it to be recorded when the sun's coming up. So we need to be out early, which is gonna be good fun. Good morning, it's the 7th of April, 4.55 in the AM. We're getting ready to go out, gotta get that caffeine in the morning, especially this early. There they are. It's open. Good morning. All right. Good oh. morning. Hey, what's up? Hey, Tash. Hi. Hey, Aiden. Hey, what's going on? I was going to bring it to you, but I couldn't find my mug. Yeah. I feel like a right mug. Mate, you can't be prepared. You're right, Grant. He's mm. not awake yet. Grant's not awake yet. Calibrating the drone, getting that ready, waiting for the sun to come up so we can get this epic shot. All done. All done. The drone's all ready to go, just waiting for it to get to a good light level. Um, and then I'm going to send it up. I'm going to do one of the intelligent flights on here. I'm going to do waypoint flight. I'll set it to stop over the car and start all the way over there, so then it will just do it automatically because then you get a really nice dead straight line. So we're here at the location about to film the very first shot of the drop-off. We've got the Phantom 4. So yeah, we're just literally waiting for it to get a little bit lighter. I've got my trusty head torch. Thanks, Mum. <laughs> See, you thought it was going to be a waste of money, but absolutely <laughs> not. 
Here we are with Grant. He plays himself in Breaking In Nine Lives and now the soon to be third part, the drop off. How are you feeling? Tired. What time is it right now? Yeah, it's half six. Half six in the AM. AM. Should we go for a shot? Yeah. Yeah. Unit, unit, people use. What? Yeah. Unit, unit, people use. 200 meters. Just the Let's go first, man. Yeah, we can do another one this time. Is it? Is quick? Okay. Go for it. Okay. Action. Basically, we got a couple takes. Um, looks good, but now the sun is really pouring through and getting that nice glow that we came here for. So we're gonna go ahead for another. So what's going on, Grant? Uh, the army's turned up. Um, it's a regular, regular sight up on the moors. Um, I think there's a horse approaching as well. You get all sorts here. Yeah. All done. Oh, look at that light. We are wrapped on yeah. the first shoot, first shot for the drop off. Yeah. Wrap on day one, it's quite about seven. Yeah, Rob said it's looking really nice. It's a lovely location. How's um, it feel to be back? Oh, it's like I've never been away. We've got the shot. It looks amazing, it came out really well. We've got a few variations. This is Tash, the producer. She's produced pretty much every short film we've made. Um, so she's producing this one as well. So overall, it's gone really well. Yeah. Really nice morning. Still got a long day ahead. Well, what else we got today? We've got location scouting. We're going to go around to look at some diners for the scene that uh, proceeds this one. And then later on, we've got a read through with Grant and the other actor, Tom. First time reading the script together. See what works, see what doesn't. Hear it out loud. It's going to be great. It's going to be a good day. So we just got to the first location. Basically, it's not going to work because of the way that the car park's laid out and the way the windows overlook the car park. We've got a very specific shot that we need to get. Um, it's just not gonna work. And it's just not gonna work. Success. We have found our location for the, for the diner scene. Oh yay! The Windy Ridge. The owners are absolutely adorable. They're so nice. Lovely. Such nice people. Yeah, they totally given us free reign to do whatever we want um which is just insane they just seem very very cool very chilled out good it's work really good. natasha so now we're heading off to do the read through with the actors now grant and tom see you there so we're here ready to do the read through we've got grant there tom who's also in the film and then aiden director and we also got camera recording it. This is Tom. He's playing himself in um, in the drop off because he was also in Nine Lives and Breaking In with Grant Lang. So yeah, we're gonna do the read through. Um, should be good. What do you mean today? Sit here sulking and refusing to eat. Oh no, I found those ones. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Grant. Sorry, Grant. Sorry, Grant. Sorry, Grant. Sorry, Grant. Sorry, Grant. What a long day. Um, so yeah, basically, that's the end of our third vlog, third week. I feel like this week has been really jam-packed. The last three days, I am absolutely knackered now. The last three days have been mental. Hopefully next week will be good. Uh, we were meant to be filming on the Monday, but that's been moved now. Yeah, see you next week. See ya.